If you post a lot of Facebook Reels, you probably want to repurpose them to publish on Instagram and TikTok too. I would guess that's why more than 130,000 of you are searching for a Facebook Reels downloader. So I'm going to show you how to download Facebook Reels super quickly in this video. What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm Brandy with Life Marketing, the digital marketing agency with a mission to help small businesses grow. Real quick, please like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of the marketing videos we put out every week that can help you grow your business. All right, so before we get into the three ways you can download a reel, first I wanna clear up one way that does not work. When you tap the three dots on a reel and you see the option to save reel, that is not going to save the video to your device. That is gonna organize the reel into your saved videos on Facebook for you to return to and watch whenever you want. So to actually download a reel to your phone or laptop, keep watching for these three methods. Option one is to download it before you publish it. Edit your reel completely with everything you want on there, minus the song or video. Then while still on the editing screen, click save and then tap download to save it to your phone. This is the easiest way because it downloads without the Facebook Reels watermark and it's super simple and quick. From there, you'll find the reel saved in your phone and you can upload it to Instagram, TikTok, YouTube Shorts, or wherever. Option two is to download them after they've published from your creator studio. Just go to business.facebook.com slash creator studio to get to your creator studio and make sure Facebook is toggled at the top. Then click publish and click reels. Then take your mouse and hover above the reel you want to download. Click the drop down and click download HD. Then you should see the file saved to your device. You can organize it into whatever folder makes the most sense for you. If I click on mine and open it, we see the reel downloaded in HD and again with no reels watermark, which is what we want. The reason you don't want the reel to have a watermark is because other platforms will recognize their competitor's logo on your video and intentionally reduce your reach. Instagram already does this when it sees reels with the TikTok watermark on its platform. So having the plain reel saved without a logo or watermark on it is best if you intend to repurpose it. That way you get optimal reach. And then lastly, option three is to use an online downloader. If you just Google free online Facebook Reel downloader, you'll see a ton of options to choose from. Now, transparently, I have never used one of these and websites like these can tend to be on the sketchy side. So if you have to use one of these, please do so sparingly and with caution. I wouldn't want you guys to download a virus or anything like that. Now, I will say if the idea of posting reels or repurposing them for other platforms sounds overwhelming or like something that you just don't have the time for, we do offer short video management services. So I will put our contact link below for that if it's something that you're interested in. All right, now before we wrap up, I wanna leave you with a few resources for creating reels for business. I have a complete guide to Facebook Reels that has helped over 100,000 people in creating Reels for their business so far. It's a free video you can watch, so I will link that below. I show you how to get more views on your Reels in this video. I show you how to monetize your Reels in this video. And while these two videos are not Facebook specific, I share short video ideas brands can use for their business accounts, and all the ideas I share in those can be used for Facebook Reels too. So all of that will be linked below. Otherwise, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell, and I will see you in the next episode.